More than a decade ago, Cynthia Germanata, co-founder of the Born This Way Foundation with her daughter, y'all know her, Lady Gaga, their mission is to support and improve the mental health of today's youth. And it is more important than ever. A recent CDC report that caught a lot of people's attention found an overall decline in mental health among teenage girls. Cynthia, good morning, and thank you for being here. Yes. This is so important to talk about. Good morning. Yeah. Thank you for having me. I hope some moms and their teens are paying attention right now because, as Willie just said, the CDC put out these staggering numbers. Uh, what Before we get into all of the work that you're doing, do you, what were your memories of raising teen girls? Probably not unlike yeah. a lot of parents' <laughs> memories. I mean, first and foremost, I'm a mom. It's challenging. There's no question. You know, when they go through certain phases of maybe puberty and mm -hmm. wanting to feel part of a crowd mm -hmm. and like they're cool. Um, it's hard when you reach those challenging years. So I wouldn't trade it. Um, but I, I also wish I was better equipped as a mom and had better tools than I had, especially when it comes to mental health and, mm -hmm. and knowing some of the warning signs. And it's an entirely different experience now. I have a teenage daughter, even than it was when you were raising your daughters with social media mm -hmm. and yeah. seeing themselves or not seeing themselves back in the phone and judging themselves and all those things that contribute to this CDC study. What do you think it's important for people to be thinking about with mental health, with young women in particular? Mm -hmm. You know, I think the most important thing is, is um, approaching them with compassion and understanding and developing a level of trust when you're talking to them. One of the biggest deterrents um, for young people, the reason they don't talk to their parents yeah. or adults, is they feel judged. Yeah. And they also feel that we as parents, we don't really share our own mm. mental health journeys with them. And, and that's important. They want to hear it. So I think it's very important to, to model the kind of behavior that you want. They're difficult conversations to have, but if you have some of the right tools, which, again, I don't feel that I had, mm -hmm. and I would encourage parents to try to become more literate and read more about those warning signs and how to have healthy conversations. Uh, like we're doing at Born This Way Foundation. Yeah, I was going to say, you know, your daughter, Lady Gaga, has been such a role model for so many because she has kind of helped with the stigma of mental health. She's talked about her own struggles as a teen, as an adult. Um, I'm sure that makes you pr so proud. It makes me very proud, but I have to say I also didn't quite understand it mm. in the beginning. It's very personal to our family. Her journey was difficult. It started in middle school. And then as she gained, I guess, her voice in the industry, she would talk about her struggles very openly mm -hmm. to her fans. And as a mom, I, I used to say, why are you being so private in public? Mm. And then I came to realize that she was healing. They were feeling empowered. And yes. they were saying, you know, Gaga, if you did it, how can we do it? And how can we be part of, of creating a change? So I'm proud of her for sharing her story. We've really learned the the uh, power of storytelling mm -hmm. and that others realize they're not alone and, and there's hope for them. Mm -hmm. That's what it is. You don't feel alone. And we never used to talk about it. Even when we no. were kids, anxiety, depression, all these weren't terms we really used. And no. now to have someone like your daughter saying, it's okay. It's, in fact, it's important to talk about these things. It makes such a huge impact. Mm -hmm. um, you all at Born This Way Foundation created recently a Be There certificate. Mm, Tell us about that. This is very, very cool. It's cool. It's, um, we think it's revolutionary. We developed it with a partner in Canada called jack.org. And um, it's a free um, online mental health course uh, that helps young people support one another. We know through our research that when a young person is feeling mental health struggles or they're in a crisis, they would rather talk to a peer or a partner instead mm -hmm. of an adult, but they're not really equipped. And that's where this course comes in. And it's a 90-minute course. It's available in English, Spanish, and French. Mm -hmm. And it basically teaches you how to recognize when somebody is struggling, to know what your role is in that conversation, and how to connect that person to help if they really need it. And it's, um, we have over 50 people a day taking the training now. Uh, you can download your certificate, you know, when you've finished. And it's very simple, but it's also very actionable. It mm -hmm. has these five golden rules that are interchangeable, but they help guide you through how to have the right conversations when somebody is struggling. I love that. Is it right on your website if people want to check uh, it out? 
Oh, absolutely. Yeah. It's on our website, right. and it's, it's really from any browser on your laptop, mm -hmm. on your phone. And we try to meet young people where they are. Totally. And we know they're on their phone and they're on their laptops. Mm -hmm. uh, you know what? I love the fact that y'all are empowering young people to help others around them and help themselves. It's yeah. so, so important. important. Cynthia, thank mm -hmm. you so much for being here Thanks, today. Cynthia. Thank you for having nice us. Nice to see you. Thank you for shining the light on this. And with Teen Mental Health Month, we hope that every teen takes the, the Be There training. Awesome. Yeah. I think they will. Thank I hope you. So. Thank yeah. you. And thank parents, you. too. Why not? Why not? Yes. We'll be back right after this.